I was a very popular girl. I won friendliest in high school, but I knew something was wrong. I started having feelings of hopelessness, really in um, probably grade school. I have had depression for as long as I can remember. Early childhood was extremely abusive in every facet of the word. I was small, I was skinny, I was, I was weak, which was not a good combination in Alaska in the 70s. There was so many emotional explosions in the house. I'm getting beaten up at home verbally by mom, I'm getting beaten up physically at school, and I thought, the world is insane. Major depressive disorder is a cluster of symptoms. It is a lack of ability to function in the world in the way the person wants to. It's like being rolled along underneath a wave, a big wave. And I'm telling you, you are not coming up. I was not coming up. I, to my core, don't think I deserve to be alive. And I don't want to feel like that anymore. But for a long time, I was a coach. And so people know me as Coach Kim. So they'll say, I love to swim, I love Coach Kim. I was a rock star in the Navy. I got Junior Sailor of the Year, I got a lot of awards. I have three Navy Achievement Medals. The Navy gave me the external validation that I needed for a really long time. To be better, you have to tell the truth about yourself. Um, in my case, that included being gay. I was carrying a secret, so I drank over that. I didn't want to be different. I went three times into psychiatric uh, facilities by my own hand, you know, trying to get better. My early ways of coping with depression were through humor. I grew up listening to stand-up comedy. I learned to seek out the sad parts of my life and turn them into humor so that I could find something positive in those. I'm an ex-athlete, I've always had a coach, and those prescribers are my coach, those therapists are my coach. If they tell me to add a medication, I do it. The things that I do that are non-medication oriented because I will not live just okay not doing it. First of all, I box three days a week. You got about 30 more seconds. <laughs> Don't get me. I realized after a few years that I needed to do more than just take this pill. It was keeping me from sinking into the depths, but I would sit on the couch and say, I want to be happy. And then one day I realized to be is a verb. Maybe I should do things that make me happy in order to be happy. I don't wait to say, am I depressed? But what I have to know is I can do this. And so the second I feel it, I tell myself, Kimberly, you can do this, get to work. I am getting better at saying, that has nothing to do with me. I'm still gonna go for this walk. I'm still gonna meditate today. 